Okay, ladies, you asked and I am answering. Y'all said, can you please do a video on shapewear? So many of you asked that, of course, I'm going to do it. It's why I do what I do. Around the holidays, we all want to look our very best. I mean, obviously year round too, but when we're going to be attending numerous parties and events and maybe seeing people that we haven't seen for a long time, we want to make extra sure. All right, so I just did a big haul from Skims and Spanx. I just got them. I have not tried anything on. I'm going to do that for you today. And as always, I will give you my absolute true feedback. This is not a sponsored video. This is just my honest opinion. First, I wanted to review for you one of the hottest selling and best selling Skims product. I mean, okay, this is really, really tiny. What is this? This is their mid-thigh sculpting bodysuit. This has an open gusset, which is really nice because who wants to tug with this after you've had a couple cocktails, right? And then the other thing that people really like is the little spot for your butt. So it probably gives you nice butt shaping, but we will see. Then I also got, this is from Spanx. I love this on the inside. The biggest risk in life is not risking. I love that. This is their Encore mid-thigh bodysuit. This is supposed to be the answer to skims also has a butt thing in the back and then it also has an open gusset so they did well there okay without further ado let's try this puppy on and see what we think come on back Hold up, I am on my way I'm in motion. okay you guys so that was interesting if you've never tried to get into shapewear before like come on <laughs> Woo! okay YouTube is kind of weird about stuff like this you guys so I'm hoping this is not see-through I'm <laughs> gonna do the nipple thing this is the skims this is in the Oprah nude you can see that it fits nice in the bust it does hold you in. Um, I can't turn around because you're going to be able to see my butt and I'll get demonetized. And oh my God, my neighbors are just walking by. It's really embarrassing. Um, here's the thing that I'm actually surprised about. I don't feel stuffed into it and it doesn't feel overly constricting. Honestly, I always kind of thought shapewear has to be the most uncomfortable thing that you'll ever wear. This is not. This is actually really comfortable, very breathable. It doesn't feel any different than if you had like um, a fitted Hervé Leger dress on. I can see why it's really popular and I do like the fact that it's got the gusset underneath so you can go potty. Let me show you with a fitted dress. Stand by. So obviously this isn't a holiday dress, but I just want to show you guys how it makes you look smoother. So here it is in a white fitted dress. No lumps and bumps, no panty lines. You can see in the back that it's nice and smooth and it feels good. On a scale of one to 10, I'd have to give this one, I'd say a nine or a nine and a half. Very comfortable. I like that it smooths me out. You guys, if you've ever wondered why somebody small would wear shapewear, I don't know that you need it for everything, but I can understand why you would want something like this because you're not worried that you've got panty lines. You're not worried that there are lumps and bumps where maybe you don't even have them. It's just got a nice smoothing effect. Let's see how this compares to the Spanx version. Stand by. This is the Spanx version and it is a little see-through so I'm having to do a little uh, editing. The Spanx version was actually a lot easier to get on. What I like about it differently than Skims is that the part around the thigh isn't as tight so it's not kind of giving you lumps around your leg. Uh, it also has the open gusset. It feels a little nicer than the Skims. I think it feels a little bit silkier and smoother. It also lifts your bust really nicely. You can see that it does hold you in pretty nice nicely. It also has the butt cheek thing so it gives your butt a little bit of shape. It's very comfortable. It's not giving me back fat which I like. Nobody likes that. Let me try it on the same white dress and show you the difference. Same white dress. Honestly I think they both look nice. I don't really see a big difference. Let me show you from the back. Between the two, I actually like the skins better because I felt that it gave me more of that hourglass look and I did feel that it was just a bit more comfortable. For me, I like the skins version better. Here's the white dress just with regular underwear and a bra. I know this isn't the right bra, but you get the idea. So you can see that it does make a difference. Obviously you don't want your underwear showing through a dress or your bra, so it is much more smoothing and seamless. Three key points in looking your absolute best in almost anything you wear. One, wearing the right dress for your body shape. I recently did a video on that. I will put the link for you down below. Two is tailoring. It has to be perfectly tailored. Three, and this is a make or break, the right undergarments. Whether you wear shapewear or not, the right undergarments will make or break your outfit. Okay, guys, I know this is a bit risque. The things that I do for you. This is the Spanx low plunge neckline 
waistline, low plunge back, mid thigh bodysuit. This will be great for all of your plunging necklines or if you've got a low back dress. I do like this again, you know, of course it's a struggle to get into, which I'm not used to. I don't know if it's just my body shape or what, but I feel that this is better around thigh and butt area and it's not as form fitting around the core and the waist, but it does have a nice fit. It does have the gusset. It is very comfortable, I have to say. Let me show you back. Nice little plunge. It is a padded bra. It's probably a little bit small for me on the side, but again, I think it's just my body shape. Let me show you what it looks like with a dress. I'll put this dress on for you guys. It's one of my only low plunging ones. Ugh. She's, this is why you don't get dressed in front of people. It actually works perfectly with this kind of a plunging neckline. A side note, I probably wouldn't wear this with this dress because it's making my boobs look way too big. But if you are smaller busted, this is a really great option. You're gonna get the support, you're gonna get the smoothness. On a scale of one to 10, I would give this an eight. And this is the Spanx Low Plunge Neck and Back. This is the Skims Shine bodysuit. This is one of their newest lines. I don't like that it is like a granny panty back because I don't, I don't know, I don't like granny panties I like a thong better I don't <laughs> okay so skims is probably a little more risque um, I would never wear this out I believe that it is meant to wear with jeans or a skirt and then just like this with maybe a jacket or something over it if you're smaller busted this might work for you it does hold you in it is shapewear it is very slimming and smoothing so I do like it from that aspect for me this would be a no because I'm not walking outside with my boobs hanging out like this Although you know what, it would probably work really well under a fitted dress, so I take that back. This would work really well under a fitted dress, and this is the Skims Shine bodysuit. Okay guys, and then the last piece that I wanted to show you from Skims that I actually really like, it's like a core panty brief. This is a great smoother for jeans, slacks, a skirt. What I liked about it is a couple things. One, it has the butt cheek thing, so you don't get like unibutt. And then the other thing that I like, it is lined around the waist with, it's almost like kind of rubberized, you know what I'm talking about, so that it stays put and in place and it's not sliding up and down. So overall, comparing Skims and Spanx together, although both were comfortable and the Spanx might have a nicer silkier feel to it. I have to say that I like the skims better. I feel that the skims is much more effective. I felt that it gave you more of that hourglass effect and look and I felt that it gave you better support. So my vote is for skims in comparison to the two. Okay y'all I put all of the links for everything down below that I liked so that you can check it out and peruse for yourself and until a couple days from now I'll see you later. Last Bye y'all. I thought about how things can One day, we have our 